So, yeah. Um, oh, oh, and my nails. I went to the nail salon to do my nails. And after they told me, because I have put tips on for Valentine's Day. And after they told me that I could still put the glitter on, they said no. They said unless I, I wanted glitter tips. So I don't know if it's, it was a miscommunication or a misunderstanding. But they couldn't do it unless I did my whole nail in glitter. And I did not want my whole nail in glitter. So I just came home and did my usual. I made, years ago, made my own pastel aqua just by mixing teal and white. So this is what I usually do every year. I paint my nail with the aqua and then over it my NYX uh, aqua glitter. And um, and yeah, so that's what I, I do. So I was really disappointed. So next time I need tips, I can do it. But I really wanted it for my birthday. So because I've been sick, I haven't been out. Um, I'm The new Revlon Spring Summer Collection is out. Um, you, you'll probably find them at your CVS's, your Walgreens. HEB just put it out. I'm pretty sure Ulta, if HEB got it out, Ulta got it out because I think they get it first. Um, most of the time, I see all the collections at Walgreens, um, but... For some reason, I don't remember the Christmas co collection coming to Walgreens this past year. So um, that came out, but because I've been sick, I haven't really, um, you know, been been to HEB or anything. My birthday was great. My husband works really, really hard, and he, he couldn't take the day off. Um, so we just decided to go. You know, I ran errands, but really I was looking for the, uh, the Spring Wet and Wild, and... Um, so, um, I, I, um, you know, went out and then when he got home, we went out to eat and we had the greatest time, uh, just me, my husband and my kids just had the greatest time just sitting there and talking and just enjoying one another's company. Um, we, we bought dessert, but we didn't sing happy birthday. And I basically just took like one bite of each dessert, um, we went to a Mexican restaurant, so I ordered tres leches, I ordered flan, uh, your basic um, Hispanic uh, desserts. Uh, I ordered a dulce de leche ice cream, which is a caramel ice cream. I got one bite of each, and my family finished the rest. Um, and then, so we had planned to go out, because I really, really, really wanted to see Oz the Great and Powerful. I grew up watching Wizard of Oz as a little girl. Watched it every single year when it came out. It come out come out once a year on TV. You know, back in my day, we didn't have video, you know, VCRs. We didn't have the DVDs. So we looked forward to that every year. So I was really looking forward to Oz the Great and Powerful. And so um, I got sick. At first, I thought it was really bad allergies because I had some really spicy stuff. And I usually don't like spicy. But, um... I just said, what the heck, let me put it, I had a veggie burger, and um, I, my daughter had, when she went to go get it for me from the, um, you know, from the shelf, she picked out the wrong kind, so I put the salsa to compensate uh, for the flavor, because I wasn't crazy about the flavor, and I felt it like burning my throat, so I said, well, maybe I just burned my throat, but um, um, it, uh, it just started getting worse and worse, I kept coughing and coughing, until finally I was, you know, sick, but it wasn't as bad as and usually when I'm really sick, my chest is congested, my sinuses are in pain, but it wasn't really that bad. And I probably, it probably by yesterday, I sh it should have been almost completely gone, but um, I really wanted to celebrate to see the Oz the Green Powerful and it wasn't coming out on my birthday, it was coming out Friday. So I set it up to meet with my brother and his girls, and we we uh, was both you know we we went out on Sunday, and I you know had a dress, I had my sweater on because I knew it was kind of chilly. The winters here are kind of weird; they could be cold all day, but sometimes it's hot all day and then cold at night. Um, the temperature goes up to seventy, and then it could drop to forty. Um, and I really need to learn that I keep in my head; it hasn't sunk in. I feel like this is Texas. I shouldn't need a sweater and a coat, and I go out without one. But this time I said, well, I'm going to bring my sweater. I need it in my jacket. Um, so I just went out with my sweater on Sunday. It was raining. Um, not a lot, though, and but the, the rain made it cold. And even though I had my sweater, I was still cold, and I pretty much had a relapse. So 
Um, my sinuses, uh, like I said, were not inflamed, but my nose was stuffed up. Um, and that finally cleared up, but now my chest is congested. So, um, my throat is still killing me. <laughs> um, like I said, I think it was just a relapse because, you know, going into the theater, coming out, and then we, we had to wait at the restaurant and it was, wasn't even like some big fancy restaurant, but since everybody had come out of the movie theater and it was like kids eat for free or something, it was like packed. And I went, I waited outside for a few minutes and I could feel the cold going through my throat. Um, thank goodness they had chairs in the waiting area inside, but I could just still feel the cold going through me, just going into the theater, coming out, going into the restaurant, coming out. Uh, and then we went to my brother's house to watch The Walking Dead. I'm telling you, people must think I'm a terrible Christian watching crazy stuff like that. <laughs> but anyway, I had a really nice time. I bought, as you saw in the video, um, I bought a Tres Leches cake. Um, and I was going to buy me a fruit, but then I noticed it had fruit on top. And only like one strawberry looked like it had some sort of sugar glaze. The rest looked like I didn't have anything on it. So I was eating... Um, I just ate the fruit, as you saw in the video. I, I, I had one bite of the cake, and that was it. Um, so yeah, um, so that's, you know, I, I spent it with them. They sang happy birthday. It was just so nice spending time with them. Um, so yeah, the, you know, this is what it's all about. And, um, so, um, so yeah, I'm, I'm here and I, I feel like it was just of God that I come here to be with my brother. Cause he, you know, as I stated before, he was going through a separation and, um, most likely a divorce and he because of that by law you can't leave the state because of the kids um, neither she can nor he can so I'm really glad I'm here for him and he's here for us too you know so that's I'm just so happy to be with family again unfortunately the circumstances aren't that great but I'm just glad to be here with for him and with them so I, I tell you, I got back into crocheting I, I, I finally got myself Oh, I'm so, I was so excited about this. I, I forgot to tell you. One of the reasons I could not relax since I got his because we got rid of our sofa and we got rid of our um, computer chair. Because my son is heavy and he leans back and it breaks often. And um, so um, I just was sitting on a regular table chair, which is not good for my back. Not all day, anyway, and um, I finally, I think it was around Christmas, or, or no, around Thanksgiving, um, they had a sale on the recliners at Big Lots, and so I got a, a recliner rocker, and uh, I had a really hard time with it, because it, it, you know, it was on sale, it was cheapy, cheapy, it was not electrical, and it only had like one or two positions type of thing, so it took me a while to get my groove, and then... Um, so now I got back into crocheting and I'm almost finished since I'm so tired all the time. I just sit down and crochet and watch Netflix. So I'm almost finished with another blanket. So I'm really excited about that. But so that's what I do to relax. I crochet. Um, and then there was a sale um, at, um, at Office Max or something for um, computer chairs. And it was for up to 400 pounds. So it's perfect for me and my son. And it's very comfortable. And so finally, my body at least gets to relax doing that. So after a long day, I, you know, I'll go, I have the computer chair, I have the rocker now. And um, so, yeah, so that's what's been up with me. Um, and uh, so, yeah, I'm really, really, really uh, trying to find this Spring Forward collection. Uh, I've been seeing like people on my Facebook um, beauty page. They've been finding it. And it's like, oh, the anxiety just kills me. And I've been sick, so I'm not going out that much. Um, so, um, so I have, but I every time I go out, I, I hit for my birthday. I hit about six or between six and eight Walgreens, about four CVSs. Um, I went up. I, I what I really I went to H E B. Uh, after dinner, my husband took me to the tackle shop because I love tackle boxes for putting makeup. And I always wanted to get a tackle box. Um, and uh, so we got me a tackle box for my birthday to put my makeup in. And um, so, yeah, I have not found it, but 
first sight, uh, North, um, Northern California's got them in. Um, the North, seems like the North East and the Northwest, most of the stores have gotten them in. CVS just got them in in South Carolina. So, you know, New Jersey's um, Harmons. New Jersey's Harmons. Um, Bed Bath & Beyond has Harmons, but for some reason my Bed Bath & Beyond doesn't carry Wet n Wild. Um, but yeah, but on my birthday, um, uh, another thing that I did was I went to Sephora and, um, I had some points accumulated. Um, so it was, I got all benefit. Um, so I picked up this pore thingy, which they usually don't work on me, but I wanted to use my hundred points on something. And out of all the stuff I said, let me try the benefit one. So it's like a pore, um, you know, pore thingy, it minimizes your pores, so that was in my 100 points, and the birthday gift is, um, a mascara, and like a, a facial highlighter cream, see, a little tiny one, and a small mascara from, um, from, uh, that's also from Benefit, uh, it's called They're Real, let's see how that goes. And I've been dying to try because I've heard everyone rave about Benefit High Beam. So I asked them if they could give me a sample. So they did. And so I'm really looking forward to trying that. Um, I didn't buy anything. Well, one, money's really tight and everything. But also because what I really wanted, they didn't have. I wanted to try the Too Faced Peacock Glitter. Because it's like a brownish with like um, aqua sparkles in it. And they don't carry the, the glitters anymore. So I was going to get that with the glitter glue. Um, they don't carry the glitter. So I didn't get the glitter glue. What was the point? Uh, from Too Faced. So, um, you know, we'll, we'll, I'll probably wait for another, you know, to get it from Too Faced when they have an, a friends and family sale or something. And, um, and yeah, still waiting for Lime Crime to make their glitter glue available so I can get that theirs. And just... You know, keeping my chin up, call, even though I've been sick, I've been calling Walgreens and CVS every other day, driving them crazy. My HEB, I've, I'm, um, there's another HEB that I found that's not too far from me. Um, they carry makeup. So I've been calling all of these HEBs every other day, even the Walgreens near my brother I've been calling, <laughs> um, just calling my local stores and I don't know I'm just hopeful that it'll eventually turn up here so yeah so just been you know on the lookout to get the new when while spring eyeshadows um so so yeah so they're hitting your they're hitting your um major drugstores now so you know hopefully you guys will be able to find it hopefully I'll be able to find it